Now down to the business of finding out what the pH is. The pH is the negative log of the acid concentration. Now this is making some assumptions. Number one, we're going to assume when we do calculations of pH in this class that we're dealing with a strong acid. I'm talking about an acid that completely ionizes when you put it in water. Completely breaks up into H plus plus another ion. Second, we're going to assume that it's a monoprotic acid. In other words, it only gives off one hydrogen. If you use a weak acid and there's more than one hydrogen, that significantly complicates the calculation of pH and that goes beyond the scope of this course. So we're just going to calculate pH for a strong acid like hydrochloric acid and a monoprotic acid, again, like HCl. Since pH is the negative log of the H concentration, well, the concentration of a strong acid is the same as the concentration of H. So it's the negative log of 0 0.10. So you might ask, what is the negative log of 0 0.10? Well, you just put 0.1, and then you hit the button that says log. Actually, in this calculator, you have to hit log first, and then put 0 0.10. And then I'm going to hit equals, and I'm going to come out with negative 1. That's what my calculator is telling me, negative 1. But this is the negative log. So if the log is negative 1, to get the negative log, all you have to do is just reverse the sign. Negative 1 is the log, positive 1, or just 1, 0, keeping our significant figures, that's the pH. The pH of this solution is 1. To find the pH of this solution, negative log of 0 0.0010, log 0 0.001, and that gives me a log of negative 3. So the negative log would be positive 3. 0, because two sig figs, two sig figs. As you can see, this acid is a hundred times stronger than this acid, right? Its concentration is a hundred times greater than this acid's concentration. And notice its pH indicates that. Since there's two difference, that's 10 to the power of 2, that's 100. This acid is a hundred times stronger than that acid, and that shows up here when you compare their molarities. Now the strongest hydrochloric acid solution that you can purchase, a saturated solution of hydrochloric acid, is 12.1 molar. Let's find out the pH of that. Negative log of 12.1. That comes out to 1.0827837. Whoops, let's make that negative. I have to reverse it. My calculator says that that log is a positive number, so I have to reverse this. Three sig figs, negative 1.08. Yes, it is possible to have negative pHs if your acid is really, really strong. Remember how they told you the pH is a scale from 1 to 14? Well, <laughs> they lied. Or, I'm sorry, they oversimplified. I'm just adding an extra piece to that puzzle. So which of these acids is strongest? <laughs>